This motor is a Rolls Royce and it was built after the war between 1940, end of 1945 and 1949. It was what they call an experimental motor. Rolls Royce were deciding whether they're going to scrap metal, another 5,000 of them after the war, or they were going to use them in uh, passenger aircraft. So they tried to remove, and they did remove, a lot of the running gear that the actual Rolls Royce Merlins had. But it's the same configuration, everything's identical on the, on the uh, barrels, the pistons, five and a quarter inch pistons with a five inch stroke, and they also had the same crankshaft, everything was identical to what they used in the Merlin, Mustangs, Spitfires, they're all exactly the same. It was called an RM50. That was the actual motor that they used. I've restored this one. It starts and runs. It's in very good condition. When I got it, it was in a box. This motor's got 12 cylinders. It's a V12. So the 1100 horsepower comes from the 12 cylinders. They produced 25,000 of them. It has 1,100 horsepower without the supercharger and it also has a five and a quarter inch piston with a six inch stroke. It uses 11 litres of fuel per minute and it runs on 100 octane fuel. But no, it runs really good. She starts first kick, it does 2,000 revs in two seconds. It uh, was built in uh, Dubbo in Scotland and they said they don't know how it ever got to Australia because it was an experimental motor, an RM50.